Okay, Paso, Capricorn. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, Mercury. This will be a general reading for August 2024. What can Capricorn expect in August 2024? Knight of Cups, the Tower, the Magician, the Hierophant, Six of Swords, Queen of Swords. It can be terrifying when seemingly out of the blue, your manifestation manifests. You were wishing, you were waiting, you were hoping, you were praying, you were doing affirmations, lighting candles, and then boom. All that you asked for, all that you requested, and a lot extra just shows up. Okay, you wanted a really intense romantic sexual relationship? Here you go. Careful what you wish for. You've wanted this... For a long time, it's manifesting in August. Could be an age gap. I feel like this is your person of interest, the Knight of Cups. This is you, the Queen of Swords. If you have Sun in Capricorn, you could have Mercury in Aquarius. Um, but you have something in error. I don't know. You probably have a luminary or a personal planet in Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. So you're the Queen of Swords. You've manifested this, this relationship. It's long distance. It's intense. This person could have Sun in Pisces, Taurus rising, Moon in Aries, just one possibility. I see a lot of communication I do see reciprocity. I do see mutuality. Please provide a three-card energetic summation for my Capricorn Collective. Ten of Shields. The Universe. Eight of Cups. It's going to get really deep and scary really fast. By scary, I mean it's real. Okay, I see two people who want each other. I see two people who are willing to take off the mask and be real, be vulnerable, be authentic with each other. This is going to be a damn decent relationship but you got to get through the scary part can i trust this person can i show them who i really am yes yes six more cards for my capricorn collective their life in august 2024 Jack of Diamonds, Knight of Pentacles. Jack of Clubs, Knight of Wands. Ten of Spades, Ten of Swords. Five of Diamonds, Five of Pentacles. Queen of Spades, Queen of Swords. All these signifiers, are you kidding me? Six of Clubs, Six of Wands. For some of you, it could be third party, possibly multiple party you're in a relationship and this person's in a relationship something has to end for the two of you to be together there is a lot of uh, tension there is a lot of heat there's this sense of urgency we've got to be together we've got to make this work i see obstacles but this is going to work out. This is going to be an amazing relationship. You got to go through the dark stuff, the scary stuff to get out into the sun, sunshine of your love, cream. 
you have to go through that long, dark tunnel of not knowing, not knowing where you stand with the person, not knowing if they are as into you as you're into them. Yeah, this is equal. This is mutual. I am seeing reciprocity. Please tie it all together with a pretty pink bow for Capricorn. Jack of Spades, Knight of Swords, Ten of Hearts, and Cups. Queen of Diamonds, Queen of Pentacles. Yes, this is going to turn into a deeply gratifying, long-term, long-lasting relationship. But you got to go through the fire. And it will be very intense. You'll feel like giving up. You may cry in frustration. There may be some purging. But you and this person are going to be together. It's all falling into place in August is what I see for Capricorn. If that does not resonate at all, feel free to watch for your other placements. I'm always available for private readings. All the info is in every box. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out.